I'm I'm recording this on my phone because I haven't got anything else to record it on, but things have taken a bit of a turn for the worse today. Um, on a snow day as well, which is really annoying. So it's really hard to get help. Um, I've had to phone an ambulance and stuff because I'm really unwell. Uh, I've been trouble with my breathing and I've got very bad pain and keep going dizzy and like passing out. So. Uh, yeah, I need to get some help quite quick. So yeah, we'll see what happens. Good job I'm not dying. Like, it's been an hour, hasn't it? An hour that we've been waiting for this ambulance. I know the weather's bad, but I'm very unwell now. It's really annoying. And I can't seem to... Finding it hard to keep consciousness. And, uh, yeah, I'm in a lot of pain. What time does all this start? Look, there is ambulance people. <laughs> there you go. I'm not well. Annoyingly, my mum and dad can't even come up because of the weather, which sucks. I'm on an ambulance. There's a dude there. <laughs> There's I've been told some things, but never a dude. He's the dude. Uh, I feel really unwell. It's not fun. I'm lucky enough to get blues and twos. That's cool. Can you hear it? Wow. So well, I kind of think I'm don't talk a bit now. Okay, so I've seen the doctor and they think it's spread up this side of my neck and then towards my head. Uh, I'm losing sensation in my face and uh, down my side. So we'll see what happens. They're going to get me an emergency CT. So, yeah, all fun. Okay, so I'm in the hospital and basically they think it's spread up my neck and into my brain. I'm um, losing cognitive behaviour and stuff. Uh, so going for a T scan now, I've just snuck out to the toilet. Last thing I ever wanted was it to go to my brain. So hopefully it's not. Hopefully it's something else. They stabbed me in the arm again. Mm. Not good. Not good. So I have a carcinoma there, a sarcoma there, and another sarcoma that's 3.5 centimetres there. And they now think it's spread to my brain my neck so I'm gonna go and have this CT now I've got the dripping and yeah that's that had my scan feeling poo really poo pardon <laughs> Claire just said I had to feel poo in my scan that's a bit weird very weird um, very good. Still waiting for my scan results. It's half one in the morning. Uh, my face is still numb there. And uh, my arm as well. And I feel like poop. And that's there. Somewhere. And there's everyone asleep. It's horrible. Horrible. It's quarter to four in the morning, is that right? Ten to four in the morning. Uh, the CT has proved a bit inconclusive, so they're keeping me in uh, to do an MRI uh, in the morning. Uh, they can feel lumps up my neck, so uh, we need to figure out what's going on. Fun. And I'm fed up. I'm tired. Very, very tired. And I've lost a lot of blood. They just stole it out of my arm. Cheeky vampires. Uh, I'm going to be honest, I'm so fed up with this now. It's ridiculous. <clears throat> ridiculous. 
certain people have had uh, more than enough opportunity to try and fix this for me and help me. And they haven't. It's ridiculous. So it's the next day. What time is it? You don't know. Half seven on the 2nd of March. We're in hospital waiting for another scan, an MRI. I feel like death, a lot of morphine, and other painkillers um, to stop the pain in, in all here and yeah, down my side. It's weird because the pain is just literally this side of my body and nothing over this side. Uh, it's, it's such a strange sensation. Uh, I can't really describe it, so yeah. Hopefully, we'll have the scan soon. So, I'll catch up then. Um, waiting for an MRI now. Um, finding it tough. Um, quite hard cope with now. Uh, yeah, I'm quite scared to be honest. I keep crying. No, I don't want it. Wish it wasn't in my body. Horrible. Oh, I feel really rough. Uh, just so as people know, if you can't get anywhere, make sure you force it. I've got all my drug charts and I can now get decent pain relief. Thank God. Time for a scan. I've got the sexy dress on again. <laughs> okay, so they let me go now. Um, we've had the results and uh, it's not spread to my brain, which is brilliant. It's still in my lymph nodes, it's still in my side, we know that. I've got no blood clots or anything like that. Uh, they think I could have possibly had a like neurological issue or um, mini kind of stroke. I uh, had a few symptoms of it and everything, so that's a possibility. Um, they're going to look into that more and find out. Um, my treatment plan's been put in place with um, my team for next week, starting next week, basically. Um, and hopefully we'll get this all removed from my side and we'll have some other treatment done. And then hopefully it won't rear its ugly head within a couple of weeks again. Um, yeah, hopefully we'll, we'll kill this cancer off. Hopefully, and I won't be in this situation again, fearing for my life. And that, yeah, I'm positive about it now. I, I am gonna be this. I wanna enjoy my life, and I wanna help other people. And I don't wanna be dragged down by it anymore. So yeah, thank you everyone for watching. Thank you for supporting me, and yeah. Thank you, and I've videoed everything, so I'll put a proper video up later. Cheers.